Don't touch the her. With me, John Bishop, Boris Johnson, and barber shop owner Mateus. He's Polish. <laughs> Mateus, please 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 Mateus, crop me, please Mateus. So, here we are inside Mateus' barber's shop, which is called Crop Me, please Mateus. I love that name. And Mateus is the man responsible for giving Boris Johnson, Bojo, a normal haircut. Well done, Mateus, on sorting out that barnet of his. You all right there, Mateus? Are you rocking? Very well, Mr. Bishop. Uh, very well, thank you. He's non-stop throughout the day with those scissors. He won't be cutting my hair though, as since becoming mega famous, I go to a swanky salon. Oh yeah. Now, let's speak with the Brexit frontman, Boris Johnson. Oh, yes, uh, uh, hello uh, everyone. Do, do you think People, and by that I mean the British public, will listen to you more and take you more seriously now you no longer look like Wurzel Gummidge. Well, 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 I'm not, uh, I'm not, uh, I'm not, uh, I'm not too sure. Whoops, Matthias has dropped his scissors. Butter fingers there, Matthias, butter fingers. Now, Boris, just for a few moments, you can pretend that you're Prime Minister at PMQs. God help us if you ever are. And I'm gonna be Jeremy Corbyn with some questions about the Brexit from me mates. See? I've created here in Matthias' barber's shop shit. He's dropped his scissors again. We'd better put accident and emergency on standby. So, yeah, what I've created here inside Matthias' barber's shop is a PMQ's role play scenario. Do you like that, Boris? Well, uh, I have to, I uh, have to, I uh, have to, I uh, have to. Typical politician. Why use one word when you can spout out a hundred? We've got no time for waffle this morning, Boris. We've only got a couple of minutes. First question. If we leave the EU... Will I stop receiving the really annoying Windows 10 upgrade messages on my computer? Uh, no, uh, no, but, um, 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 yes, yes, uh, uh I don't know, uh, I don't know. Ha <laughs> ha, just thrown you a curveball, dear Boris. Here's a question from me mate, the Badger. We call him the Badger, cause he keeps getting into trouble and going underground. Here's his question. Do blondes have more fun? F forget that. That's for Boris Becker, that one. Let's try another one. This one's from, yeah, the Rooster. We call him the Rooster. Cos he's always up with the cocktail, Mr. Bishop. At 10.30 in the morning, 
No bloody way. Now, the rooster's asking if you were to get a double puncture, do you, Boris Johnson, tackle it yourself or take the bike to the bike repair shop? Forget that one as well. That's not relevant to the Brexit either. Right, here's one from me on a subject that's close to me heart and me head, yes. Climate change and the use of her dryers. Are you, Boris Johnson, gonna block the 30% EU power reduction on the new her dryers? Oh, well, uh, hang, hang on, hang on, hold, 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 hold on. Uh, there we go again. Typical politician. You can't get a word in edgeways. No answer and I'm none the wiser. I just want a straight answer to a straight question. Oh, wait, 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 wait. I'm, I'm not interrupting you, Boris. There go the scissors again. Even Charles Bronson, if he were alive, would be taking his chances coming in here. <laughs> Please, my tails, please, my tails, please, my tails. Please, my tails, please, my tails, please, my tails. Drop me, please, my tails. I have to say, Boris, I'm still not convinced by the arguments whether to leave or to stay. Excuse me, Mr. Bishop. No, I still don't want to cocktail, Matthias. It's far too early. I'll take one home, though, for the missus, if you like. Just cling film the top for us. No, here uh, I have, uh, I have uh, a sponsorship form. Are you running a marathon, Matthias? I'll give you a pound for every mile completed. And that's pounds, you know, not the euros. No, I have uh, thousands of pledges here, totaling £10,000 if I were to bike ride from London to Brighton. I've done that, you know, in just two hours. No, I give you a, a shot back and sides. No way, Matthias. Are you still here, Boris? If you're that desperate to cut a celebrity's hair to raise money for charity, why don't you have another go at him? Shave it all off this time. Me, the bish, I'm like the Samson of the comedy world. If I were to lose me long hair, I would lose the ability to tell the great gags. Me kids who still live at home, I wouldn't be able to feed and the wife would have to give up the horse riding. It is for uh, a lot of money, Mr Bishop. I don't care if it's for the Liverpool FC transfer fund. You're not giving me a short back and side. <laughs> Boris, you'll be pleased to hear that I'm gonna be joining your camp. I'm leaving. Good job, I've got me Nikes on. Please, my tears, please, my tears. Please, my tears, please, my tears, please, my tears. Clock me, please, my tears. Please, my tails, please, my tails. Please, my tails, please, my tails, please, my tails. Please, my tails, please, my tails, please, my tails. Drop me, please, my tails. <laughs>